I guess go to that adult. We are all an extension of Mud's legacy. I'm a leader of the blush when somebody says your name. In my stomach, there's a pain. You walk in my direction, I go the other up way. I start to stutter with the speed. You understand me, but my knees go weak. What's happening to me? Yo. <laughs> Y'all say get the mother dogs up out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Man, 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 you. I'm the old man. <laughs> the hell? <laughs> I am the old financial risk. Mo was smart enough and gathered enough business savvy to overcome this. We come from knowledge, from persistence in the pursuit of our goals. Mo was a God-fearing woman, a woman who raised all of her children in the church. God is at the foundation of this family. That legacy endures now as we gather weekly for a family prayer Zoom call, and I hope to see some more of y'all there. No, no pressure. Feel free to hop on. We come from a woman of God. Mo was a devoted and loving mother. She dedicated herself to her children in spite of a divorce and a separation. She poured into each and every one of her 12 children. And that's why each of them poured so much love into each and every one of us. We are blessed to come from a woman of love. When propositioned by her mother and father to leave the kids and move to California to get established and then send for them, Mo refused because she couldn't bear the thought of leaving them and not knowing how they would be treated. Once asked, what is the hardest thing about being a mother of 12? Mo responded, when they leave home. We come from an agape love, the highest form. We are all an extension of Mo's legacy. Her sacrifices, her lessons, her greatness, it's all action to each and every one of our DNAs, written into our very essence, into the fabric of who we are. Again, family, such a blessing to be here, and I can't say it enough. So without further ado, because y'all look like y'all hungry, maybe cut the ribbon and christen this part, our part, must family part. Thank you. Uh, I'm just happy to be 
everybody showed up today. And, uh, and, uh, we had a good time yesterday, and I'm here for Roy. I remember uh, we were here last April. I was old at when I was Roy uh, two years ago. I remember Roy said, we need to get together. I see you put that chainsaw down, first of all. <laughs> and, uh, and, uh, and, uh, so we can get together and things other than him and things like that. And uh, you know, Ain't Cal and Ain't Dave, they've been running with this, you know, for the last year or so. And the first time, so we're just happy to be here and what's the only thing? We're going to unveil it. And David said, I was ready. He was like, we got to have a side cam. We got to have a side cam. <laughs> <laughs> I listened to David all the way. his auntie and I was his auntie when he was young. When I was born, he was my nephew. How about that? But, but, but y'all, give Stacy a hand. This was Stacy vision. I just said table and chair. Stacy dressed it up for y'all. So thank you so much. And please get the generator started, Stacy, so we can get this hand going. Okay, David. Mom, I present to you guys, David and Josh, y'all gotta get that down and just go lightly. Mom's family party. Staring out the window, trying to stop on sight. The reason why. 